I'll just have an energy drink and like a protein bar. But this morning I just really wasn't feeling that. And I wanted a real breakfast and I don't regret my choices. I got home yesterday from traveling. Um, we were back home in Brazil, which was summer and gorgeous. And today is literally seven degrees Celsius. Don't know or care what that is in Fahrenheit. It's raining, it's so frigid. I'm currently waiting for the USPS truck to move. They're blocking my way out. Hello. You can put it there, thank you. <laughs> mm. I've missed driving immensely. I grabbed a Celsius, which I might regret. I honestly don't like having that much caffeine, but I also want to grind at the gym, and I feel like this will help. Yo, I forgot about this whole, like, New Year's resolution thing. There's no parking! I'm so far from the building and it's pouring. Went in the sauna, which is the best part, but now I'm wet. Let me tell you, the Celsius definitely worked. That was a good workout. I think it was there for like an hour and a half. And I went in the steam room, which was so nice. It's literally my favorite part. But then I leave looking like this. So it's 2.05 and I have a haircut at three. So I'm gonna grab a green juice really quick in my favorite place. And I'm feeling a little congested and I don't have time to get sick. And a lot of the times when I travel, I get sick. So I can't do that again. So we're gonna be eating really healthy and taking care of ourselves this week. So nothing happens. It better be ready because I really don't feel like waiting. So we'll see. It was ready, thank God. It's got a really fun, colorful thing going on right now, and I'm not sure what the pink is. Apple, cucumber, kale, spinach. There's no way that apple made that color. Maybe there's like a really crazy, like, separation of pigments by density going on. It's too good, some would say. Too good. I got home and was like, I'm gonna be proactive and already get the mail because I know it came. It was like frozen whilst we were traveling. You know 90% of these are from colleges sending me posters. Queen, I'm already in a college. I'm already committed. Give up. I'm back. I washed my face, but I didn't want to do my whole skincare routine to wash it off in an hour. So I put on this Caudalie Venosource Hydra Mask. I got this while I was in Brazil and I really like it. You can leave it on just for 10 minutes to soothe your skin or leave it overnight. So I threw on a pretty thin layer on my face and neck so it can hydrate whilst I'm gone. Then when I get back, I wash it off and my skin will be gorgeous. I just got jump scared by that gate. I had to park so far from where I get my hair cut because there was no free parking. And um, last time I paid $20 for parking and then got an $80 ticket because I typed in the wrong license plate. So that's how I'm doing. Hair's been cut. The way it literally looks straight right now because it's like dry and there's no product in it. I literally hate downtown. No, that's a lie. I like it, but like sometimes it gets hella sketch. Couple areas that are like literally so scary and sketchy. I just realized the sign by my car says two hour parking Monday through Friday. So what about Saturday and Sunday? Is it more than two hours? Is parking not allowed? So I did realize there's no chance I'm cooking and we don't have lunch plans. So I'm gonna stop by Chick-fil-A and get a chicken sandwich and I'll start being healthy tomorrow because I already like ate a Nutella croissant this morning. So like, there's no point in trying today. Long time no see, it's 5.54. You couldn't see that, but it's 5.54. We've been taking all the Christmas decorations from the whole house up to the attic, and I am exhausted. And now I have to clean my room and put away the final things from the trip. And then there's some other little things I have to do, but these are the priorities. I'm so sleepy, and I need a shower, because I got my hair cut. Let's clean. Now that that's done, I need to try on this suit. It's very preemptive, but when I saw it, I was like, I need it. It didn't fit, so this is the new size. So let's try it on. Okay, so it definitely fit better. I don't know if you can see, they're a little long, but that's kind of easy to get tailored. 
It definitely needs like a necklace. I guess it's double breasted, but the buttons are hidden. I love a double breasted suit because I love this like asymmetry almost. Approved. Okay, so I'm gonna set a reminder to tailor that before the event. Um, but now I have to do little work and then at eight my friends are coming over and we're gonna hot tub. So I won't be showering because showering four times in a day feels extremely excessive. So I'm gonna probably like rinse my head off. I changed sweatshirts and I might or might not have rinsed. I didn't shower because that's excessive. I just couldn't have little hairs. It was really getting to me. Is anyone else on their duo grind? Because I need to be speaking Italian. I don't love the new interface, but I'm getting used to it. It's just, I was on duo for so long for Italian like a year ago that I got so used to it. And now that it's different, I'm like kind of sad. I'm like, I want it back. So I'm reviewing like all of Italian and all of French because I did it a while back. So I want to make sure I still remember what I did. It's getting a little confusing because both are very similar. So it's time for my duo grind. Dottore, io, uh, si, io sono un dottore. Everyone just left. We went in the hot tub. So I'm feeling dry and parched. My whole body is like So I need a shower and deeply moisturize. I'm gonna turn on my candle. Tree farm. Because it's January, which means it's still winter, which means it's still kind of holidays. So, ooh, this is a vibe. My skin feels like, it's like screaming. It hasn't been this dry in a while. Not only did I go in the hot tub, but it's getting adjusted to like the change in seasons. This is gonna be intensive hydrating, like skincare. You'll see what I do. Started with La Roche, Utechmal. I'm from Rice Toner, Neogen, Soothing Essence, Tippy Taps, Tippy Taps. This is the secret. La Roche Posay Cicaplas B5. I like the cream, but it's a spray, you guys. Great beauty. Great barrier relief. I love the smell. It has tomato oil in it, which is like a really niche smell. Now, we're gonna go in with the secret. If y'all have dry skin, if you have normal skin, and if you have oily skin, if it ever gets irritated, this is the secret. Like it's literally magic. And they reformulated it like around a year ago. Now it's even easier to spread. It used to be like a little too thick and it was hard to spread. I'm like, hello. My skin's a little red because I've been rubbing it, but like, you can tell. And tomorrow, I'm gonna wake up and look like the supermodel. This is the best. I think I've decided I'm going to sleep. I'm so tired. It's currently 1.22 a.m. It was so good to see you guys. I guess I didn't see you guys. Like, it was so good to have you see me. Um, I say this every time. I've been gone. I'll be back, hopefully. I just love, we can't do this again. We do this every time, but like, I really just, so I'm gonna go to bed. Hugs and kisses, hope you had a good holiday season and happy new years. Hi 2024, how are ya? It's the year for us, just you and me. Good night.